Good morning guys, it's the day after Miss Brighton 2017, Lucy came third. If you didn't see the previous vlog, go back and watch it now. She came third place in the whole of Miss Brighton, it's amazing. It's Monday, I think it's Friday for you. I'm out early, I'm gonna get us some nice coffee. I've gone to the nicest bakery in Worthing. I'm gonna get us some nice breakfast to celebrate. It's a nice day, it's a bit windy. Let's go. Oh my. Morning. Morning. You changed accent overnight. <laughs> that did sound a bit weird, didn't it? Morning. Look at this. This is like the kind of breakfast that you. S that's massive. It's like the kind of breakfast good, you see online when you online. wake up with a hangover, and it's like you need this right yeah, now. Yeah. How are you feeling after coming third? Oh, I'm so happy. The next day. It's weird. Like everyone's messaging me, and I'm looking back at all the photos. I still need to watch the videos you've done actually. Yeah. Yeah. You watching this now? You would have seen the Miss Brighton vlog, but we haven't even edited it yet. Right. Oh, can't wait. Let's go and eat this. We got our coffee, we got our pastries. A massive, massive breakfast. So big. Happy days. All up and dressed, guys. Except for this lazy one. I've been up and dressed since I'm joking. Nice. I'm, joking. I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. It is now two o'clock, guys. We've just had a nice day. We're both off today, so we've just kind of been chilling out, haven't we, relaxing. I'm still feeling not too good, if I'm honest. <clears throat> Got a bit of a cough. No, you're not. No, no, no. You feel a bit bad, but you are milking it. <gasps> so. How dare every you? Every five minutes. Oh, I'm not feeling too good. Really? All oh, right. I thought you were fine considering <laughs> you 14 times. Hadn't mentioned that. No, don't be I mean. I bad that you're ill, but you are milking it. You've got a bit of a cold. Like, it's not. No, I have got. Uh, for the last, like, how long is a cold meant to last, guys? I've got no it's been idea. been three days. <coughs> four. It's been four days. Ridiculous. It's been four days. You may notice we've got the old drone box out. Yeah, guys, we are going to try and fly the drone today. It's quite a nice day, so we're going to get out in a minute. Yeah, we just we've tidied the flat. You know, as much as you can do when you're ill. Guys, we're up. We've left the house. It may be late in the day, as per, um, but we've left the house. We are in Lewis. George's idea. Apparently, it's nice. I've never actually been to Lewis before. My only memory of Lewis is what it was that it was one of our like teams in sports day in middle school. That's all I think of when I think Lewis. Really? Yeah. Oh, it all looks quite oh, shut. Closed Monday. Closed Monday. Really? Yep. What? Lewis isn't open on a Monday, is it? It's so random. Nice wall no, for Instagram right. photos. Well, he's painting it. We can't really stand yeah, next to it. We'll just say one it. second, mate. Don't know about that. Using the keypad on your telephone, enter the parking location number. West Street, yeah? Yeah. One seven two nine one. One seven two nine one is West Street Car Park, Lewis. To confirm, press one or press two. Park in minutes. Press one. How many? Or to, to choose a different duration, press the star key. You this just a part. Two hours. Is a card ending. That's one time when carrying no cash on you is not a good thing. Took us ten minutes there to. Uh, park via phone and it costs us 40p more than it would have done if we had cash so Why? what's that? I thought I was that model car. Really? Except the wheels fell off because I was a kid and I played Brilliant. too much. What's it worth now? Fifteen pounds. Oh there you go. <laughs> Look after your toys, kids. Yeah. This place is confusing me. We just went into a camera shop that had all like cameras outside. Walk in, one wall's cameras, the other side shampoo. Bizarre. What is this place? I found cool <laughs> to take some photos. All right, go on then. I can't take it off myself. <laughs> Must... this massive camera. <laughs> raining now it's going well it started to pour down actually that's an exaggeration it's not pouring down um, but it's a nice little town actually we just walked over a bridge which crosses a river yeah. which is generally what bridges do yeah um, idea, isn't it? and we're looking for a nice little coffee shop basically we're going to stop get a coffee some cheeky little piece of cake and we've been taking some photos for instagram as well so check out our instagram right, no, thank that's, you. Great. that's great that's great thank, thank you. you we found the nicest looking little bakery called the flint owl bakery i've ordered a chocolate is that wrong? 
No, Flint Al Bakery. I've said Al yeah. I've ordered a chocolate brownie and a flat white. What do you go for? A chocolate brownie. Peanut brownie. Yeah, I've got a peanut brownie and a Sicilian lemonade. Mm. So I can't it's a bit colder. And I was going to have a hot chocolate, but I thought chocolate brownie and chocolate hot chocolate is a bit like chocolate. So, lemonade. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. How good does that look? It was good in my mind. Do you want a swap? No. Are you sure? Oh, this looks dreamy. <laughs> We're back home guys. It's raining outside so sadly we didn't get to fly the drone did we? I feel bad. I know, sorry guys. The drone footage as soon as we get some good weather in this country will return, promise you. We had it in the boot, we charged up the batteries. Anyway, we did manage to take some good photos today so I've just imported them all into Lightroom and I'm just going through some of them. There's like some of Lucy on the wall and then some of me at this random table that we found i'm gonna just edit this up this is what we used to edit lightroom loads of people use this and i've got my own preset which um i'm gonna click it now it's, i've just named it pop i made it it just kind of makes the photo pop uh. so before after oh i don't think you can really tell before after before after i don't know and then i put it through vseo put a little filter on it and straight onto instagram Alright, I'll do mine. Okay, we'll do yours. I'm off to band practice in a minute, so I'm actually going to leave you in the capable hands of Lucy, who is obsessed at the moment with Louis Theroux. Such a hard name to say, Louis Theroux. Louis Theroux. Louis Theroux. We've just discovered all his episodes. If you don't know who he is, he's all like his a guy. episodes! It's of a series. It's not just like all of his episodes. We've discovered all his episodes. No. We've discovered that the series of all his like documentaries. We've not discovered his episodes, that's hilarious. You know what I mean. That is such a funny way to say it. <laughs> He's a journalist, basically, who goes around the world. This is quite old. This is like <coughs> early 2000s. <coughs> Finished? Good. You've given me your illness. I know. Yeah. He basically goes around, like there was one about gambling in Vegas, one about it like racist that? people in America. He went to stay with this like oh racist God, it's family. Crazy. It's like Some really stuff good there. stuff. It's really like hard hitting stuff. So it's really, really interesting to watch, actually. So if you go on Netflix, just search Louis Theroux. You guys probably heard of him anyway. He's one um, of the memes and stuff, isn't he? Yeah, but this is... I never really knew who he was or what he did. But you learn so much. We've watched like five different episodes. Each of them are in a different country. Completely different topic. It's, yeah, it's not about the country. It's about the topic. It's about, yeah. There's loads of them in America. A lot, most of them in America. I think all of them have been in America. Yeah, America. yeah, I think so. And it's basically just like... Um, like you said, so there was one about... Um, it really surprised me, actually about like the fact that they I I am this probably sounds stupid to some of you probably knew this, but like Nazis and stuff, they're still like activists that like believe that that is their life and that they're supporting it and they're like it was crazy, wasn't it? We were watching it and they're like teaching these young kids like the Hitler salute and stuff. And yeah. we were literally watching it like oh my gosh, like that's crazy. Yeah, it's pretty sad to be honest. I but know, um, yeah. but it, yeah, so it's not like a light hearted watch, but if you're looking for something but, I know yeah. us guys we share Netflix recommendations, box sets, TV and stuff. So if you're looking for something a bit more serious, then I recommend it. But then it's, some bits aren't that serious because like, like there's one about like brothels and stuff, but Louis like makes it quite funny. Oh yeah. Like, it's not like, obviously it's like a sad topic in some sense, like some of the people on it, but yeah, it is, he makes it, it, it's not like hearted, is it? But he makes it like, he puts a spin on it. And I don't makes think it he, accessible, he yeah, easy he, to watch. He, he doesn't mean to be funny, I don't think, either, which makes it quite funny, because he's... What is my hair doing? Guys, I'm literally just looking through photos from, like, Miss Brighton and videos and stuff, and, like, everyone's still messaging me, like, congratulating me and stuff, and it's, like, it's so weird. Like, it's been such a long process, suddenly over, and it's, like, really strange, because it's, like, I've obviously done the skydive for it, loads of interviews. It's been, like, like since about... I think it was February. When I was going to be going to the audition, George was, like oh no do it do it and I was like oh I don't know it's not like me it's not my sort of thing so George was the one that sort of pushed me and went no no do it it'd be such a laugh and I'm so glad he did I've literally had the best time and if any of you guys are from around Brighton you should so apply next year like it's so much fun and I can't wait for like all the photos and stuff to come out because it's like a professional photographer was there and stuff and she'll have all the photos and I can see them all I still can't believe that I was on stage in a bikini in front of my family that's weird 
Like everyone else's bikini, this is embarrassing, but everyone else's bikinis were like normal. Mine, for some reason, decided to work its way up my bum as I walked, so my whole bum was out. Apparently it looked alright, but even so, like, it was embarrassing because as you go down, you obviously see, you've already seen it on the vlog, I don't know why I'm saying this, but as you go down towards the judging panel, which is where you do all your poses, that's where my family were, like both sides. One side had like George's family and my friends, the other side had my mum and dad and their sort of partners and things at the front, uh, my sisters. So it was weird because I was right there. They had like the best seats, so it was great. They were at the front, but I was right there and I was like, you're right, like... Oh, it's so weird. Such a cool experience. It was so much fun. And I'm so happy. The whole night was themed on Beyonce, so it was all like girl power, and it was like the best music I could have thought of to pick. Like, it was the best. I'm wearing my glasses today, guys. What do you think? They're, I never wear my glasses. Like, I always vlog in contacts. I look weird about them on now, I think. Let me know what you prefer, because I'd be interested to know. Because I normally wear contact lenses. Well, I meant to wear glasses. I said, I'm literally rambling on. I don't know what's happening. I meant to wear contact lenses four days a week and glasses three. But what I tend to do is wear contacts every day. And then at the end of the month, I run out of contact. So I have to wear my glasses for a week. Which is what I'm doing now. I'm off tomorrow as well. George isn't. What am I going to do on my day off? I might literally... I haven't had a day... She says lying here on the sofa. I haven't had a day where I've done nothing for so long. Like, l nothing at all. Like, not even put makeup on. Is that really bad? Is that a waste of a day? It is a waste of a day, isn't it? Well, Giorgio's been out. I've also edited up this photo for Instagram. And this one as well. It's like more of a details one. I look so dad. It's ridiculous. I had a spray tan, obviously. And I'm literally orange. Love it. Back from band practice, guys. Lucy's got Love Island on. It's the first Lucy, episode. Yeah, I'm watching it as well. But Lucy, it's the first episode of the brand new series. And I didn't watch this last year. Lucy got properly into it. I'm not being horrible, I need to watch it, I need to concentrate. All right, we will give you a full review of the first episode of New Love Island after this. Episode one of Love Island is finished. I'm not liking the adverts. I think tomorrow night when I watch it, it's at nine, on nine o'clock every night for seven weeks now. I think I'll start watching it on catch up maybe because I don't want to do the adverts. I like Montana. I like Amber. I have the guys. Don't really fancy any. Dom's all right, but not loving any yet. Look, it's crap. Like, if anyone's never watched it before, it's crap TV. It's like it's Big Brother or something like that. A rude version of Big Brother, basically. But yeah, I think there's a good group of people this year. Things are already, like, getting stirred up a bit. So it's definitely going to be, like... I literally go on the hashtag Love Island while it's on. And, like, every second a new tweet's coming in. And it's just so funny. I need to go to bed now. I'm tired. What? Quarter to 11. Thanks so much for watching today, guys. I'm going to end it here now. Georgie's just doing the washing up. Bless him while I'm monging out on the sofa. Thanks for watching today. Give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Um, we promised some drone shots soon. Honestly, every time we try and do it, it rains. It's really annoying. If you want a shout out as well, let us know because we haven't done any in a while actually. Um, so give us a comment below if you want a shout out and we'll do them in the next video. Thank you so much to everyone as well for all your messages um, congratulating me on the uh, third place for Miss Brighton. Um, and we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye.